Now, as you see now, and how to make money and how to recruit members. And I need how to recruit members. I need to know how to how to get out my man good. How to All right. everything, you know. Get All members, right. Get members, get big members, man. All right, dude. All right, hold on. Welcome back, everybody. Okay, this is gonna be like a little uh help stream because. Everybody who ever wants to join my channel, they want to know how to play this game, and they don't know how to play this game correctly. Yes, Vault Tech. Hello, kill yourself. Yes, hello. I love you too. Um, because this this will be like how to play this game. Uh, so first tip, watch. Bye. I hate this game. I will probably stream something different, Vault Tech. Uh, I'll probably stream some Fallout or whatever, whatever I got. So so then you can stay around and sin sin hate. Normally, I don't stream on these days, but I'm doing this to help out somebody and to help out anybody that wants to play this game and they don't ask me. All right, so here's the thing. I'm going to go over three things. How to become king real quick, how to make money, and how to upgrade your men and get commanders or soldiers into your army, like guys with names. So let's see. What Which one should we do first? Uh, let's do... Mm. Let's do. What? Which one you want to do first out of those three? You want to get how to get your troops up high, or get money, or get uh, more? Men. Men. Get men. Men. Recruit men. Men. Yeah, 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 man. All right. So the fastest way to get men in this game is to help out villages. The the higher that the village likes you. Like, okay, let's say, um, is this a village looted? Yes, okay, hold on, then that's not a good example. Is this one looted? Okay, this one's not looted. So, I know this village doesn't really, uh, I don't think they like me that much, but if it's zero, um, they will just give you some one or two men. If it's, like, b above ten, they'll give you seven, six, five, they'll give you ten men, they'll give you twelve. Um, so yeah, zero. So you can tell uh, what the what this place likes you is by the populace is indifferent of, uh, to you. So zero. So these guys will give me like one or two or sometimes not even none. But if you have negative, negative one through ten, they'll give you one or most likely they'll give you none. And anyone down, they'll just give you no more. They'll give you zero men. Uh, no, so Jewish. M my nose? Don't think so. Um, and let's see. And this is how you make money. So you guys see this town that I'm at, right? So you see these little villages. So let's go down to this. So you see this grain? I will buy this grain right here. Here's the example. This is how you make money, real quick. So obviously some some uh, villages. That's why you have to hit up multiple. They will have thousands of wheat, dirt cheap. I would probably only say purchase the ones that are about 20 denaires to about mm, 10, 10 to 20. Um, buy those and anyone lower because that, that gives you more money. And the town that sells you the most for wheat, I'll tell you basically the, the important parts, uh, parts. This place, oh wait, no, no, no. This place up here, you can buy cloth down uh, at the Roduke area, up here in the mountains, buy cloth here, sell it up here to make uh, a 400 denier profit, but cloth is over a thousand denier, so you gotta already make, you're gonna have some money. If you have wheat, go down to Proven, Proven will give you the most profit for your wheat. Sunno will give you the most profit for your ale. Anuxal will give you the most profit for your ale too. Um, so in the middle of the map, that's where you can sell ale, and right here is basically all the wheat farmers, all these little villages right here in the middle of the screen, uh, like right here. These, every single village here, like Chide all the way down to, uh, I can't even pronounce that. Uh, yeah. They sell wheat for two, two denaires. You head down to Proven, you get about 40 denaires each bag. And you only paid two denaires for like each bag and you get 20. So that's how you make money quick. Or if you're really good at the game and you level up 
by attacking. So like if you see a bandit, um, you attack that bandit so you level up your, your character. Plus your character will get stronger with his weapons and whatever. So when you join tournaments, right, when you join them, you always want to give out the $100 bet. Because the first one, you always want to do it. You always, no matter what. So make sure that you have money and always put down the $100 bet. Sure, um, they might be hard, but here's the thing. Uh, you might win some, you might lose some. Technically, you will, will you will only lose, what is it? You only battle eight times, so 800 denaires. So if you have 2,000 denaires, and if you lost, turn, you only lost 800. And you can easily get that back by attacking bandits and whatever. And how to get men is, you see this guy running. Um, I'll try to... Wow, I said a lot in only five minutes. Jesus. Um, so what else? So that's point one. Like, big, big, big one. Um, what else? Getting men and training men. So here, here's the thing. I think I actually might kill two birds with one stone here. So how to get guys like this to follow you is... Um, you have to have an intimidating army. Sometimes you'll get people that will join your army, and they'll be like, Oh, I need some land, so... And you take the land. Well, you don't take the land. You give them the land, and they'll, they will they will come out like this. So the more land that you give your people, the more soldiers that they will have. Well, some sometimes. Like, if you give them eight cities, they'll have, like, 300 soldiers. But I will keep following this guy, right? And there will be a moment where I will get this guy to talk to me. And I can either attack him or talk to him. And I'm not going to attack him because that's... Oh, a bandit. Ooh. Bandits will not join you. Oh, wow, that's a big bandit. Look at that. 46 men. Holy Jesus. Um, Let's go to that guy. Let's just say screw that guy. We're going to go follow this bandit. This guy has 46 men. Okay, we're actually going to see something. So, you guys can clearly see that bandit, right? Okay, no, that bandit's long gone. Oh, hold on. He stopped. Yeah, I think he's... I think he's slightly faster than me. So, hold on. Oh, oh, um... I was about to be like, I should just raid a castle, but... Alright, well, hold on. Let's take a look. Um, so, if you guys need some more help with taking over castles or whatever, um, yeah, I guess, I well, let me see. Can I take on this what? place? What? They got 15 uh, Mamluks, so hopefully I don't die. So let's besiege the a castle. Go. Yes, it's the ladders. Yes! I love ladders. What? Alright. But I will show you guys how to... What? Yeah. Life, Alright, well, I have no, no idea what you're saying. So. Uh. And you know, let's kill let's kill a couple birds with just one stone, you know? I'm trying to stream uh, a tutorial video, but you know, at the same time I'm gonna gonna take over a castle. You keep saying hello, girlfriend, and that's making me confused. But no, um, trust me, this game can be easy if you figure out how to make money really, really fast. Beautiful. So you can you can buy, like I said, those those wheat bags, and you can sell those wheat bags for for profit, like omega profit. Up plus nine, and you're dead. And the more that you attack or fight somebody, the higher that your, uh, the higher that your, uh, the higher that your, uh, 
the higher skill that you have with the weapon, making you do more damage. I can, like, kind of low-key not even understand what you're saying, dude. What? So we have to be your last 10, 20 minutes then. You can use your lean back. What? Yeah. Are, are you talking to me? Alright then. Alright, I'll see tomorrow. Maybe, maybe we'll sleep. Are you there coming tomorrow? But no, uh, this will be like, I'm trying to show you guys what to do in this game if you guys don't know what to do, so, if, so after this battle, right, so if you want to know how to level up your men, you just, you just fight along with them, uh, you attack with them, and you just do everything with your soldiers, but the thing is, is, uh, the thing is, is you gotta make sure that uh, you have high enough surgery skill, because your surgery skill will keep them alive if they get hurt. Like, like a fatal blow has like a 10% or something that can keep them alive. So you want to keep them alive so they can level up and hit higher into the level tree. Now, of course, you can get your your, your soldiers high enough without the surgery skill, but you know it's going to be a lot harder because you're going to have to be extra more careful with your soldiers. So, after I take this castle, all the soldiers that have joined me in this fi uh, fight because they basically have their own experience bar, which I think that's pretty cool, and. Every soldier has their own experience bar. Uh, some soldiers gain more experience than others. Um, and it's pretty neat. Yeah. Uh, some soldiers do more damage than others, of course, um, because of either their high level or whatever. Because all soldiers are different. Uh, this game just kind of has... Well, because that's why you can't just... If, if you all hire, like, let's say you hire 13 peasants, right? You fight in like eight battles, or in like one battle. Some of those guys will be able to level up, but not all of them. Even though that you bought them at the same time, they all gain experience at different speeds. Some of them, you can boom, boom, boom. You can get them up to Swedean Knights up instantly, just all the way up, all the way up. But some are different. Some take way too long. And I took over this castle, so. I'm going to try to explain, um... Talk to them. Attack! Mm -hmm. Oh, you want me? There we go. That's actually one of the lords, so yeah, he was gonna kill. So, everybody that joined me there was going to level up, guaranteed. So, I'm just gonna also just take everybody here, because, you know... Oh, and this is how you also get soldiers, too, is if you attack a castle, you can get some soldiers back. But since I didn't lose any, I got a profit off of that. So, yes. Look, you see, some of the soldiers are ready to level up. And it just, it just all depends. Like... It just, it just all depends. Like, look, I just got one of these looters just now, and he's ready to level up. You see that? They all go at a different time. You just gotta be, you gotta be patient to make money. You gotta be patient to get higher soldiers. So, this is one way how to level up your soldiers, is through battles. How many uh, I think I got... 11 or so, something like that. But. Nine, nine. What? How many men have you got? Oh, uh, oh, in my army? Well, let's see. Yeah. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. 
25. 25 boys. What is good, Dark? What is good? Uh, I'm gonna watch you on my phone because I won't play it myself. So I'll watch you on my phone and I'll tell you to do like how to like make men, upgrade your men, build, make your own castle, get a wife. There we go. Him, I'll just I'll just take over this castle. I'll, I'm gonna take over this castle. Oh she. Hold on. All right. And tomorrow is your day off for you too, then. That'd be your day off. Wait, you take okay. a day off? I don't have a day off. You lucky. Alright. What do you mean? I'm gonna... what, what, what? What do you mean? I don't go college or school. Oh. Alright, well, I'm just gonna throw all my good men here. So, when you mostly take over a castle for yourself, what you probably most likely want to do is you want to put your really good guys. You want to put good boys in there because you know that they're going to they're going to do some damage. Like you know that they aren't going to just be pushovers and it's like, "Oh, look, they're going to easily die." Nah, it's like that one Swedia knight is just going to All right. Thanks for stopping by, Dark. I know, I'm sorry. It's just I'm making this uh tutorial video stream thing it's, it's like an awkward like mixture of both but you know but you know i'm only going to do this once because everybody if, if you don't slowly catch on uh then you can just watch this but you know you know i'm only going to do this once but um well, well are people learning because you're live streaming this game yeah people are getting mad why? Because they don't like seeing this game all the time. Huh? I think it. I think it's a really good game. I love this game. Yeah. So, I'm going to try. So I just showed you guys. Uh, Jesus Christ! Twelve thousand dinars lost to. Uh, What? I just made 34,000 denaires off of this one castle. Okay. So, how many men should I have to attack a castle? How many, how many men do I need to attack a castle? I would probably recommend you guys to have about, um... I don't know, around maybe... Not what I have. If you're going to attack a castle by yourself, I recommend you to uh, to do probably about a a seventy man army, and that and that's it. But if you're going up against a uh, uh, an old castle that has not been attacked recently then you're going to lose. If it's been attacked recently where there's only like 20 guys, oh, easily, easily, you can take that. Yeah, but I'm fighting now these bandits with some allies. Some people are helping me out. Uh, I'll send you a photo now, look. There we go. I'm going to be able to catch up with this, uh, this raider here, and I'm gonna. Okay. So okay, this is also how you get money. So if you're watching, you can walk up to this guy, to the desert bandit, and tell him. That's our bedroom bar. You can tell him we're gonna just gonna fight till we die. What? Yeah, dude. I'm just gonna keep talking because uh, I'm gonna keep the flow going. Because I don't want this stream to be longer than 30 minutes. Alright. So. So. Oh God. Um, what was I about to say? So yeah. This is also how you get money. How you level up your men. And. I like to go third per person. Uh, in my. Only in my horse though. But when I'm going. Uh, like hand to hand. 
I like going first person. That's the thing. When I'm raiding a castle, I only go uh, first person. But when I'm on a horse, or when I get off a horse, <laughs> then I go into first person. Cool. Yeah, that's fun. But no. Let, let me try to take out about 40 of these boys. Oh, look. Reinforcements is coming. So, at the end of this battle, right, you're, you're going... You're, you and your men will get more experience. And whoever are... If you have the trainer perk, you give your men even more experience. You share your experience with your, your soldiers. So they get even more experience from the battle. So if anybody... So if nobody got any kills, they would still go up and it also depends on how many levels that your characters will go up if uh how many people that they kill so that's also a thing if like one guy's getting kills uh he's gonna get more experience than a guy that has not gotten kills and that's why the experience bars are different because who it, it's like your experience bar if somebody steals your kill you don't get any other experience okay but if you let your guys kill some boys, right, you and your guys are going to be able to get experience points. And that's that's just how it is. So, me right here, I'm getting like 30, like 20 experience points, but you know, um, my guys are probably getting like 100. What's this going on? What's this going on? What? Yeah, see. Little boy. Okay. But no, um, oh, look, there's a guy right behind me. So, after this, then all I have to show you is how to try to convince people into joining your army. And that, oh, that'll yeah. be a stream. I'm sorry, guys, that I made this. I just, this was like a little helpful video because people, a lot of people been asking me how to play Mountain Blade, how do you play Mountain Blade, how do you play Mountain Blade. But... Here's the thing, I'm finally getting to tell you guys how to play Mountain Blade. So, now that you guys are going to be able to see and watch and literally uh, view, view my, yeah, like, watch me play, you guys are going to actually finally going to be able to get to actually see what I'm doing. So, that's not bad. Oh, come on. Alright, so now this might be the longest part. Now we have to find uh, one of the people. We have to find a person. So we have to find... Alright, I think I have a brand new idea. Why don't we... I don't want to attack more than just one castle. I just wanted to attack that one castle. Just to try to show you guys how to perfect, like, how to raid a castle. But, I might have to take over this castle so somebody can come over and be like, I want to take over my castle again, but, you know, I think that'll take too much time. Uh, so. I might have to take over my castle again, but, Alright, let's go try to find somebody. As soon as we find somebody, right... Alright, nobody's here. Ah, the king. I'll try to show you what I mean. So, how to convince somebody into joining, joining your army. But here's the thing. I, I don't see anybody, though. I own... I own... All this. Well, other than that, I just own that part. Oh, uh... And I'm in this part, bro. Yeah. Alright, so... Let's try to... Okay, I think I can do this. Uh, no, I probably can't. Oh, wait, no, I can. Okay, so I can walk up to one of these guys and be like, Hey, so... Oh, Jesus. This guy, like, right, my friend, what, he's had 700 wins on Fortnite. Jesus. I let that guy go and he hates me. 
Daisy. Go, hey, uh. All right. Oh, look, it's Caravan, boys. You guys might remember this guy. I kicked this guy out of my army. Because the guy was being way too much of a jerk. All right. Oh, look, it's Caravan, boys. All right. Uh, hopefully, I can talk to somebody like Telrogger or someone. <sighs> All right. All right. All right. Here's here's gonna be the challenge. I have to find. I have to find the king. Or right, wait, not the king, because I already have the king. I have to find someone. I have to find someone. <laughs> you know, I have an idea. All right. We are going to attack this this castle. Even though that I don't even have enough men to do it. So, because look, 410 plus 18 plus 27 plus 26 plus 15 plus 25 plus 1... That, oh that's almost a fi that's over 500 men man uh cast or village so well let's see yes okay so it's build the ladders so i shall build the ladders all right let's go down to the wall castle whoever That's a lot of math. Shoots gun to head. All right, I'm gonna lead my soldiers into it. So, and hopefully we take out a couple hundred of them. A couple of the hundred of them. There we go. That's a good headshot. There we go. Yeah, dude, these guys are actually some pretty weak sauce. Yeah, pretty weak sauce, dude. One one headshot and these guys are dead. When that other castle was like, eight headshots, they still live. Wish uh, was crossbows in Skyrim. Wait. But there is crossbows in Skyrim. So what all you men attack that castle? Yeah, I, I said I wasn't going to, but I have to because there's a lot of guys here. There's a lot of uh, people here, so as soon as I take over this castle, they're all going to run away like little babies, like little bobbies. So as soon as they run away, I'll be able to find them because there'll be less and less hiding spots for them to go. So... Actually, I think I might be able to take on this place if I'm just careful enough. I have a lot of prisoners if I'm if I'm uh, if I take on this castle. There we go. There we go. Charge. Sacrifice the children. That was another beautiful headshot by me. Another beautiful headshot by me. That was another beautiful headshot by... Did you guys just see that guy just fly? That guy right there? Oh yeah, that guy's stuck up there. Yeah, he's stuck there, dude. Oh, 
Yeah, he's stuck there. The Romans suck. Yeah. Well, we're coming yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah. That was a beautiful headshot. There we go. Happy Feminist Day. Happy Happy Women's National Day. No, let me move back, boys. There we go. Oh yeah, dude. With with the amount of boys that I have in their level. Oh yeah, we're we're going to take over this 400 man castle. No. Okay, we're going to play out. I'm going to tell you this one. Was that one? Yo, dude, turn down the volume. Turn down the volume. Turn down the volume, dude. Yo, assassin, turn down the volume. Assassin, turn down the volume. There you go. What? I said turn down the volume, dude. Because it was starting to go like, and I could hear it from the background. Sorry. That was good. Please tell me if I uh, if I asked this already, but will you play World War II? You have not asked me that, and I probably might play it. So, I guess this stream might be 40 minutes long, because I'm over here trying to destroy this target real quick. But no, I'm, go I'm going to be able to take on this castle, because look at how many boys I'm killing. Uh... With just oh, we already won. Oh, okay. Okay. Are you kidding me? I never even knew that this was even here. The zombies are hard, dude. Zombies is easy. True zombies hard. All right, let's see. I lost two soldiers. They, we lost 21, and they lost uh, 160. I will be a king. You will land. This guy's 11. I love it. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I'm gonna do this. Boop! Uh, two, and my- so all together we only lost 23 men, and they lost 126. Damn. Yeah, that, that's a big number difference. Fight them with a sword, boy. Uh, I'm gonna kill an army now. And that could be an ally. Oh, oh. I got a game, Mark. What? Alright, here we go, boys. And we are about to take take over this town. Should this town go go to me or to someone? Probably to someone. Ooh. I think that guy lost some brain cells. He was starting to swing at nothing. Yes, we won. That one. Hello. Proper there. Beautiful headshot. There we go. Come on. There we go. Just like that, we just took over the village. Or this whole town. So, thank you, Nords. Thank you for uh, helping.
And now what you do is that you say, you're my prisoners, you're my prisoners. No, just playing. This guy, I'll let you go. Everybody that, that likes me, okay. Hey, Care Band, you remember me? You're my prisoner now. Suey, baby. Suey. Alright. Hey, there we go, let's see what we got. Roduke, yes. You know, I think I can actually put the rest of these guys in my party. Yeah, I'm a king now. I'm trying to Yep, I can put every single one of those guys in my party. Alright, so... Now, since they are going to have one less place to, to run, right? Um, they're all going to start... They're going to all start trying to patrol around. So... Let's go. Alright. Let's go down to the garrison. Let's. Uh, what should I use me? Are they from Angel Fork or no? Ah, that's his own, you know. Nah, do I. Does. Hey, bro. Bah. But nothing. Oi, bro! Store. Popeye. You're having crisps or not? What? Me, not like. You're dead lesbian. Yes. You got my new money. Dead lesbian. You got my new money, friend. Here we go. Come on, money for a friend. Why? Bro, I'm off at the shop, right? Yes. I'll be back now. I'm gonna go to the shop for a Give me the feet, man. There we go. Alright, stay in the party, I'll, I'll be back. I'm off at the shop. There's some drink, coke, and that. Could be dying at you know, tonight. Mercenary horseman. Alright, then let's get on to the garrison. Mercenary horseman. M mercenary horseman, where are they? Found you. All right. Oi, bro. Uh, um, I have one or two. Alright, okay. So I'm not capable of finding anybody right now, so hold on. I paid my lunch for this house. I don't, I don't live there. I'm not staying here. Yet? No. Fucking hell, like. Oh, no. You don't give a fuck with me. I don't give a fuck. This is my house. No, you guys, not fucking Mark. Yeah? What's the fucking problem with this fucking lot? You think you can, yeah? I'm fucking moving like your own. What do you mean? I've been getting off fucking off that in the last couple of days. Oh, this one. Oh, yeah, the night. You're on the morning. Oi, bro. Sorry, mate. You're going to need quite a big one for that one. Oi, bro. 
You know, I feel like I can just take on all these castles. I have enough money where I can just say, I'll take over this castle, and... You're gonna need eight quids for that, my boy. Oh god. You're gonna need a shilling for that. Fucking shilling. You're gonna need a shekel for that. <laughs> Is that guy inside the ball? Oh my god, there's people behind us. Thrust! Thrust the sword. Boy, bro. There we go. I like how the Sultanites were like, yeah, dude, we can, we can win. Woo, I just did my legendary jumping strat of death. Alright, let's try to do that again. I only wounded two men. 
And let's see, we lost 32, and they lost 100. Yes. Oh my God! Beautiful. She's cutting me off all the time. I bet you have to go All right, well, since I can't find anybody to talk to, um, I'm just going to end the stream here. So, thank you for subscribing, thank you for liking, thank you for viewing. Um, so basically, when you try to communicate with someone, you can say, let's talk in private. So when you talk in private, right, you will um, you'll get a dialogue check where it's like, uh, what do you want to talk about? And you want to talk about, hey, what what's, what's your thoughts about the king? And then when he says, oh, I don't really like him, you say, oh, would you like to join me? And however high your per, uh, per, uh, persuasion is... If it's high like mine, like six, you gotta get up pretty high. So you have to get your persuasion up to six, and then you can um, get people to join you. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little tutorial stream. So let, I'm gonna say that in the outro again. So thank you for subscribing, thank you for liking, thank you for I will see you guys again, baby. I will. I will. Trust me. Tomorrow, Fallout. Goodbye.